Okay, guys, that was Jay Z's FUTW from uh, Magna Carter. And now, since I played a little demonstration of that song, I'm going to show you how I basically figure it out. And the first chord is an E major seventh chord. So that's E, G flat, B, D sharp. So that's one, three, five, seven. And that. That's basically E and G sharp together, right along with the B and D sharp. And that descending line is from D sharp, you're going to go down to a C sharp, B, A sharp, G. Right along with the staccato. Once again, those chords together is one, three, five, seven. So it's an E major seventh chord. E, G sharp, B, D sharp. And if you wonder about the sound I'm using, I'm using like harpsichord and like some type of uh, piano voice string thing. It's some weird, some weird uh, sounding uh, uh, thing, but it works. I like it. It suits my temperament. Uh, and then the next, the next, um, that, that's basically like an A flat minor, or you could say G sharp minor, just whatever, which one you want to use. But uh, I, I, I say A flat minor just because I like that. I like saying that, so that's why I use. But uh, it's basically that boom. So I use basically a player octave, A flat, and the bass. And um, in the top part is E flat, A flat, then D flat to B natural twice. Basically, like an octave down from A flat. And that's pretty much it. And so, putting it, the hardest thing about this is just playing it in sequence, you know. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed the piano cover slash tutorial. And um, if you have any more questions, feel free to ask. All right, peace and one love.